Hey guys, it's Emily with MJ Cosmetics. Um, thank you so much for watching my video. I know it's been honestly like years. I think the last time I made a video, I was pregnant with my youngest son who is now five. Um, but it's really hard to make a video when you have little ones running around and making noise and calling for mom. I mean, come on, us moms know it's a rarity that we even get to go to the restroom by ourselves. So um, they have now gone to bed. I can still hear them next door. Um, but I've just been so excited to make videos for you guys. And the reason being that when I meet with my clients, they're always asking me, really the same questions. And so I thought, what a great opportunity to make a video for all of you out there where I can actually answer some of these questions that most of us seem to have when it comes to skincare and makeup. Um, so this video is going to be about how to treat and how to cover dark circles. Um, I know I really don't get very much sleep, I would say, Eight hours is a really, really good day for me. Um, I usually get more like six hours of sleep every night. Um, I never used to suffer from having puffiness or dark circles under my eyes, but since becoming a mom, I have really experienced that lovely um, bruise look under my eyes. I'm pretty puffy in the morning. So um, that's kind of something that I have perfected over the years and I wanna share it with all of you. Um, so. Obviously, I already have all of my makeup on, so I am going to just demonstrate for you what I have and how to treat it and then how to conceal it. So I'm gonna start with um, just taking the makeup off from my under eye area using these wonderful wipes, which by the way are amazing, especially at the end of a really long day. I mean, we don't always have the time to take like 10, 15 minutes to wash our face and treat our skin. <clears throat> These are um, the Shine Wipes from Unique, and I used MAC um, wipes for a really, really long time, um, but I just started using these wipes by Unique just recently, and I'm absolutely loving them because they're really, really gentle. They take off all of my makeup without having to tug and pull, and they smell really amazing. So I'm just gonna start by very, very gently taking the makeup off from my under eye area. And you can kind of see right here, I get really pink um, and it's mainly because I'm so fair. So if you have really fair skin, you're probably gonna notice that those under eye circles are gonna be more red or blue. Whereas if you have olive tone skin or a medium to a dark skin, you're gonna look bruised underneath. It's gonna be dark, dark brown. So I'm just gonna go ahead and take my under eye makeup off. Okay, so see when I smile, see these poofy little things? These have been driving me absolutely crazy. I hate them, I don't know where they came from. It's like they just kind of appeared overnight. So I am first going to treat that. Um, there are a lot of different under eye treatments, but I have kind of used the most popular ones and I have found my favorite. So I'm gonna show you guys what I use to help with the puffiness. This is the Unique Uplift Eye Serum. Um, I've had this for a really long time, but a little goes a long way. And it really does help to de-puff my eyes. So I'm just going to very, very lightly apply this underneath just using a patting motion and it really helps with the puffiness. Plus, it really is moisturizing, which that's like key in dealing with under eye. Um, I inherited the skin from my mom's side of the family, so usually the skin around my eyes turns really crepey because it gets really dry. So you wanna make sure it's hydrated, otherwise you're gonna look really cakey and dry and gross. <clears throat> okay, so that's the first step. The second thing is there are so many different color correctors out there today and a lot of people I think get really overwhelmed and really confused in terms of what color to use for which skin problem. So um, I'm showing this to you guys because I know it's readily available in the mainstream market today and it really is 
um, a wonderful thing for most of us to have in our kit. This is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Cream Kit in medium. And I got this mainly because, see this beautiful salmon color? So this is not a blush, okay? This is not a blush, this is a color corrector. And we are going to use this to offset the dark circles under our eyes. So with my clients, I always use a brush. You guys can use a brush. I really like using my ring finger and that's because it warms up any emollient product so that it becomes really easy to blend. So I'm just gonna take a little bit and I'm going to use that little bit for both eyes. So you wanna start where you're most dark and you're gonna get probably a little scared because you're gonna think, oh my gosh, it's turning my skin red, it's turning my skin pink, there's no way I'm gonna be able to cover that up, but don't worry, you will. So just really, really gently pat that. And what that does is because of color theory, it is opposite on the color wheel. So it is going to cover up dark bruising, okay? So that's the first step. The next thing you then wanna do is you wanna conceal so that you don't see that pink tone underneath. Now, I know most of you have, most of you have heard of this. And if you haven't, I'm really excited to introduce this to you. This is called a beauty blender. Um, don't be fooled by all of the knockoffs that you see in drugstores and that you see in some of the cosmetic stores because they are not the same. The Beauty Blender is a patented material that is only used in a Beauty Blender sponge. So what this does is this gives you that airbrush quality that we're all looking for with our makeup and it makes things really, really easy to blend. So I'm gonna take my concealer um, right now and probably actually for like the last five years, my favorite concealer is the Kat Von D Locket Tattoo Concealer. Um, and this is in the color light. So I just take a tiny, tiny bit of that. I actually got a little bit too much, but we're gonna do the same thing and we're gonna pat it everywhere we put that salmon color. Now, the thing with concealing under eye, I know a lot of you say, oh, I always have like those raccoon eyes. Well, if you end up with raccoon eyes after you put your concealer on, it's because you're not bringing your concealer far enough down underneath your eye. So I always tell ladies, do like the inverted triangle, come all the way down to the nostril area, and then bring it back up toward the temple. Then you take your dampened beauty blender sponge and you simply start patting getting all the way into the corner of the eye and blending it down into the cheek and up toward the temple. See how easy that is? So this is a really, really simple step. It takes about two minutes to finish. Okay? Those under eye circles are gone. You can't see them. You look like you're well rested. I don't care if you got three hours of sleep. You follow these steps and you are going to look like you just got your full eight hours. So the other important thing in this process is every cream, every emollient needs to be set with a powder. Now powders are not made the same as they used to. These are not the cakey um, pressed powders. These are really finely jet milled, loose translucent powders. So you wanna get a really high quality powder that is colorless. Um, I use the Motives Loose Translucent Colorless Luminizing Powder because it adds a little something underneath. And I take that same Beauty Blender and I'm just going to very gently press it into the skin where I just applied my concealer. So what this is gonna do for me is it prevents your concealer from sinking into any fine lines and wrinkles under the eye and you will be set all day long until you take your makeup off. I don't care if you sweat, I don't care if you cry, it's not going anywhere. I work out usually in the middle of the afternoon after my makeup has been on for six to seven hours. I sweat and this does not come off. So it's a really great way to set your makeup without having to put on a lot of makeup. And that's it. See, our under eye circles are gone. 
We have no discoloration. We don't look tired. So if you have any questions, please comment below. And if there's something that you've just been dying to know, but nobody can seem to tell you and or you're uncomfortable asking the girls at the Ulta store or they don't seem to know, comment below and I would be more than happy to make a video for you. But in the meantime, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe so that you can see all of the videos every Wednesday and share with all your friends. Thanks and have a lovely day.